Hey, what up, guys? Donovan here, and uh, today I'm actually bringing you a Black Ops 3 video. And uh, this is a topic that I really probably should have covered earlier, considering the game's been out over a week. But I did want to give them a time to try to resolve the issues that I've been seeing, and you know, try to fix it. Maybe patch. I don't know. Update, because you know, every game has to have a day one patch. I don't know. There's so much crap going on with new games lately. It's insane. Now. I'm going to try to keep this video or this commentary one to one with the actual gameplay because there is stuff that I want to point out and that reminded me because I saw something really annoying a second ago. So this video is going to be centered around the insane lag and FPS issues that this game has. And I mean lag has been a problem on every Call of Duty. I mean, let's be honest. They're pairing you from people from around the world, some people with potato internet, some people who live in the middle of nowhere. There's just nothing you can do about it. And I mean, I'm okay with lag here and there. But this is not regular lag. FPS lag is not something that should be happen happening in a multiplayer game like this. And I feel like they're trying to squeeze way too much out of this game on these consoles, even on the next-gen consoles. Now, I'm going to also have a video later in time kind of centered around all the issues in general about Black Ops 3, but I feel like the FPS and lag issues are enough for one video because they're so bad. Now, to get started, in this video you will see multiple times where this game stutters. And I, I don't know if it's just me becoming a PC gamer that's kind of gotten me accustomed to looking and noticing FPS drops and stuff, but it's something that I never actually noticed on Call of Duties on like my 360 and stuff, and it honestly didn't even happen in Advanced Warfare. Now, there were also complaints about this type of lag in the beta, and my, my dude, the assist man, he even made a video like this about the beta, about the insane connection lag that people received in this game. Now, the problem with this is, is basically what FPS drops are, if you guys don't know what that is, FPS means frames per second, okay? Now, that's kind of the whole thing, it goes along with resolution that's always been in the console wars, you know, PS4 can play 1080p 30fps and Xbox can only do 900p 30fps. So basically, the baseline for a smooth gameplay, I guess, on a console is 30fps, and that Anything lower pretty much looks like a slideshow, and I bet you guys probably know how that looks if you've ever tried playing a video game on a lower-end PC. That lag is actually FPS lag. And now, what I've noticed is that the lag in this game probably drops significantly below 30 at some points, okay? Because it's enough for me to notice that, like, a person jumped across my screen, like, unsmoothly and stuff. Like, something happened right there. And that's in this video, I do want you to focus a lot more on the actual uh, gameplay than I do on my voice, and you'll notice how annoying it is. Now, the, the problem with FPS drops is that means that these consoles aren't even strong enough to keep up with a Call of Duty that was specifically designed for them. Now, when you think of, you know, FPS drops and performance issues, you think of the 360 and PS3 versions of this game that like you know look terrible and stuff they, they the graphics are insanely dumbed down on the PS3 and Xbox 360 and they just look terrible but you know that's another one of those selling points for the next gen consoles is the good graphics but the problem is is that these consoles aren't even strong enough to keep up with these good graphics I mean there are obviously more points where the game's smooth than there are when the game's laggy but this is not a problem that you should be having on a somewhat new console. I mean, the thing's almost two years old, I know that. But you know they went in making these consoles hoping that they would last almost a decade like the PS3 and Xbox 360. But nope, in a game that was specifically designed for next-gen, we're already getting, like, insane FPS drops. Like, it, it just doesn't make sense. Like, what are you guys thinking? They are trying to squeeze... I don't know if it... Let me let me make this clear, okay? I only have an Xbox One and a, obviously a 360 and a PC, but I do not have a PS4, so I cannot speak for that. But I'm just assuming since there's not much of a, you know, hardware difference between the two that you guys are getting similar issues as well. And another problem that I've also noticed that 
corresponds to lag is this is actual like traditional lag like connection lag now there's really nothing you can do about connection lag the problem with Call of Duty since the beginning is like I said in the beginning of the video you got people connecting from essentially across the world okay and there's nothing you can do about that internet can only be so fast because you guys aren't directly connected to each other first of all your signal gets sent from the server to you and then from you to the server and then to the people I mean you can only ask so much about it and one of my complaints about advanced warfare is them all adding all these new movements and stuff like in advanced warfare especially where you can base essentially just fly around is just asking for more rage because that's more that the server needs to keep up with and there's more updating per second that the server needs to keep up I know I'm butchering the wording in this and I apologize for it but just think of it this way more movement more lag because there's more points in time that that person's moving that you know just has to keep updating on both of your screens uh, I, I should probably leak an article into the description that goes more in depth with this though but an example would be like a person's wall running and you run around the corner like right there was an example on my screen I was pretty far around that corner and on his screen I wasn't that's an example of connection lag it just it just happens it's ping you know it's just it's just a crazy crap fest now I know that there are a lot of things wrong with this game right now however I do I would say I prefer it over advanced warfare but there are a lot of things wrong with this game but I feel like the the lag is just probably the main issue with the game as of right now that they should probably work on and I know there's probably not much they can do about connection lag but you guys seriously need to do something about these FPS drops because it, it it's a pain to deal with I mean first of all it's a miracle that I even bought this game on my Xbox one in the first place and then I get greeted with these FPS drops that are f f ridiculous I mean why this game was anticipated for so long and then it's pretty much it's optimized like trash on PC and it's optimized like trash on my Xbox one so that's pretty unfortunate anyway guys this was just a video that I thought deserved to be ranted about or a topic that I thought deserved to be ranted about I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I like I said I did want you guys to focus on the actual gameplay a lot more than you usually do because there's just so many points in time especially in this game that lag is just obvious it's just there you see it you see FPS drops you see everything even in situations that aren't intense but I'd like to I'd like you guys to tell me what you think about it. Um, if you guys have had any problems with it, because uh, it might just be my console. Who knows at this point? But it's happened to my friends as well. It happens to my buddy Scott all the time. And I mean, who really knows? So I'd like to thank you guys for watching the video. Remember to drop a like on it, and once again, tell me what you guys think about this topic in the comments. If you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button. I do videos like this pretty often because ranting's just something I enjoy. And anyways, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Damn, son, where'd you find this?